Hello my class 10 students. This is the sample paper 2 of ICAC Physics class 10 semester 2 exam. It is a paper of a reputed ICAC school and we are going to solve this paper. So let us start with section A which is of 10 marks. As you know it contains 10 marks MCQ questions. Element P has configuration bar, number of nucleons in the nucleus. How many nucleons will be there? 242. Four resistors, six ohm each are connected in parallel. The effective resistance will be if they are connected in parallel. Remember the formula is Rp is equal to R upon N. So it will be 6 upon 4, which is how much? 1.5, correct? 3 by 2. It becomes very cold when ice in the lake starts melting. Why? When it starts melting, it will be the specific latent heat of fusion that will be absorbed. Hmm? So what will you say? One gram of ice absorbs 336 joules of heat energy from the surrounding to melt. Correct? What are they saying? Ice releases latent heat to the atmosphere. How it releases? It will absorb from the atmosphere. Correct? Let us come to the next part. Wire of length 30 centimeters has frequency 128 hertz. The length of similar wire under similar tension which will have frequency 384 hertz. So, how will we do this? Your L1 is 30 centimeters. Your F1 is going to be 128. So, if it is 384, then how much? So, you'll have F1 inversely proportional to the length. So, F1 upon F2 will be equal to L2 upon L1. Correct? So, that will give us 128 upon 384 is equal to L2 is we do not know and L1 is 30. So this 30 comes over here. 3 tens, 3 ones, 3 two, six, and 3 eights. So how much is it coming out to be? 10 centimeters. Now 10 centimeters is how many meters? 0 0.1 meter. The fifth subpart, the body executing force vibration will be acted upon by. So if there is forced vibration, uh, external periodic force and frictional force restoring and frictional external periodic force and restoring force and here restoring frictional and external periodic force. So option is D. All will be there. The sixth subpart is missing. It is actually the internal resistance of a cell does not depend upon. So internal resistance depends upon the concentration distance in surface area. It does not depend upon the material, right? Do you remember that? Just go through those. It's important. It does not depend upon the material of the electrode. 5 grams of water at 20 degrees is converted into ice. The heat released is equal to. Now converted into ice. So we'll have water at 20 degrees is going to become water at 0 degrees and then it's going to become ice at 0 degrees C. So they are saying how much is the heat released? It will be Q1 plus Q2 which means it will be plus MLF, correct? So it will be 5 into C for water will be 42 upon 10 into delta T is 25 into 336, 420 plus uh, this into 5 will be correct, 2100. Correct understanding for a conductor, the voltage current graph is straight line when the slope calculates the conductance. Now V against I, if it is V against I, then the slope is going to be equal to delta V upon delta I. So that will be resistance. So conductance means no. Slope calculates resistance, yes. Slope calculates resistivity, no. Specific conductance, no. So option is B. High tension wires are made thick by twisting several thin wires. That's because it increases the surface area and then dissipates the heat. This is the correct one, not increasing melting point not increasing the resistance, identify no, to increase the surface area. Let us come to the 10th one to bring about a change in the property of radioactivity of an element. High pressure, temperature, no, oxidation, no, you cannot alter, correct. So D is the correct one. So that finishes our section A. We'll be soon solving section B and I'll upload the video soon. In the meantime, take care, all the best, bye.